This video is brought to you by, AE Juice. Get ready to use professional and easy to use transitions and presets, you can get them individually or you can get it in a bundle. Check out the first link in the description. Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Let's create a new composition, name it as text animation. Here I will set time duration to just 4 seconds, remaining everything will be same. Now let's add the text, here you can use your logo also, it works with both text and logo. Align it to the center. Here if you are using text, then you can use any font style of your choice. Perfect. Now let's pre-compose it. I will name it as text. For this text composition, in effects and preset, search for minimax. Add it to the text composition. Now for minimax, at near about 2 seconds, create keyframe for radius. Now at 1 second, change radius to 900. Now to see the effect. Let's change the channel to, alpha and color. Here it's in both the direction, let's change direction to just vertical. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Press U to view keyframes, change the end keyframe to easy ease. Perfect. Now let's create a new solid layer. I will name it as noise. From effects and preset, search for fractal noise. Add it to the solid layer. For fractal noise, change noise type to, block. Let's set contrast to, 500. Set brightness to, minus 80. Set complexity to, 3. In transform, Uncheck Uniform Scaling, Set Scale Width to, 500. Set Scale Height to, 10,000. Here you can adjust the offset position if you want. Now let's pre-compose this solid layer, I will name it as Noise. Select Move All Attribute into New Composition. Perfect. Let's hide the Noise Composition. Now let's create a new adjustment layer, for this adjustment layer, in effects and preset. Search for time displacement, add it to the adjustment layer. For time displacement, set displacement layer to, noise. You can see the preview. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset. Search for find edges. Add it to the adjustment layer. Select invert. Now you can see the outline preview. Perfect. Now select all the layers. Pre-compose them. I will name it as text outline. Perfect. Now let's create duplicate of this composition, for this composition, in effects and preset, search for set channel, add it to the text composition. For set channels, we will set red source to, off. Set green source to, off. Let's position this composition at 5 frames. Similarly we will do for 2 more compositions for different channels, 
Create another duplicate of text composition. We will place it at 10 frames. For this composition, we will set green source to green. Now set blue source to off. Now again create duplicate. Place it at distance of 15 frames. For set channels, we will set red source to red, set green source to off. Now to see the RGB preview, we need to set the above two composition mode to add. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's change all compositions to 3D. Now let's create a new camera. Create a new null object. Change null to 3D. Parent camera to null object. For null, press P to bring up position. Now at end of the timeline, create keyframe for position. Now at start, increase the Z position value as shown. Perfect. You can see the preview. Here you can decrease the Z position value for end keyframe. You can see the preview. Now create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset. Search for glow. Add it to the adjustment layer. For glow, set glow threshold to 50%. Set glow radius to 50. Set glow intensity to 2. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now create another adjustment layer. For this adjustment layer, in effects and preset, search for noise. Add it to the adjustment layer. For noise. Set amount of noise to 6. Perfect. Now let's see the complete preview. Here your text animation is ready. Similarly, you can create multiple text compositions. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. See you next week with another awesome tutorial.